What's up, guys? Charge Go here. We have the new rap featured on our channel, or actually on our Twitter. If you saw it, we had showcased it a few days ago. It's pretty awesome. But this video is going to be a zero to 60 comparison between December 2019 build Standard Range Plus with a 50 kilowatt hour battery pack and an LFP car, which has a 52 kilowatt hour battery capacity. If you come over here, you can also look at the new wrap and notice that the cars are pretty much the same. Now, this car has a 980 motor and the other car has a 980 motor as well. So technically speaking, the zero to 60 times should be the exact same. Now, each car is at the same state of charge, which is 80%, even though the LFP car can handle 100% all day long. But our theory is that battery degradation could possibly affect the zero to 60 time. It shouldn't, but it could. So we're gonna debunk that theory or maybe prove it to be true. So stay tuned to the very end of this video to find out. We're gonna do a zero to 60 test from a stop and we're gonna do it from a roll. We're gonna do a 20 roll and a 15 roll. So we'll see if possibly somehow this car has more top end because as we know, the batteries are different. So the zero to 60 time is the same, but this car has an NCA battery pack versus the LFP. So I think the peak voltage with the NCA car should be a little higher. So in theory, it should have more top end, but they're both standard range plus cars. This one has 50,000 miles. This one has 14,000 miles. And there's a 21 month difference in the date of manufacturing. So stay tuned to the end of this video to find out if the zero to 60 time is the same or different. Ready. were pretty much right there together there was no major discrepancy in i'd say the zero to 60 it felt like the lfp was pulling on the 2020 tesla model 3 that you can see in my rear but that was actually a pretty good first race Here we got another uh, zero to 60 roll from zero. Light's gonna go green. These cars have the same zero to 60 time. I didn't think that battery degradation would affect zero to 60 time in any sort of way, but it was something that was worth testing because you never, don't necessarily think that battery degradation and acceleration have anything to do with one another, but now we definitely confirmed that that's not a thing at all. Model 3 has some top end. I'm not sure what motor that one has, but that was actually pretty interesting. All right, guys, we hope you liked this video. If you did, hit the like button. If you didn't, hit the dislike button. If you have any suggestions for this video, or if you have suggestions for future videos, leave them in the comment section below, or reach out to us on Twitter. Thanks, guys.